hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i have a highly requested video for you guys um this is like i'm excited because it's like my favorite like part of the video making process and so today i'm going to be showing you guys how i edit my videos um a lot of people have been asking and i tell them iMovie but you know i'm taking the time out to actually show you guys how I make my videos crisp and clear and I'm gonna also be giving you all some little secrets um as y'all know or as I just told y'all I use iMovie to edit and iMovie comes on max but I know that y'all see some plugins you know throughout my videos which aren't on iMovie so I'm here to show you all that and um I just don't feel like it was like reasonable to pay $300 for Final Cut Pro um, if y'all don't know what that is, it's like another editing software. Mostly like all the YouTubers use it, I, I guess. Because it has like plugins. It has like a lot more options. But, you know, me being the person that I am, you know, I'm just going to find a way. Find a way to do the same thing. So, that's what today's video is about. And so, if you want to know how to add plugins, if you want to know how... You know, I edit my videos, <laughs> then keep watching. Also, guys, so I know that y'all see this like full screen, but I'm gonna be using this video um to demonstrate if that makes sense. So as I, when I import this from my camera to my computer, I'm gonna screen record myself editing this particular video, but I'm gonna already have it edited so y'all can see it. That makes no sense but y'all will see when it comes together that's that's the lovely part about editing like oh i just love it but um yeah so keep watching guys and i hope you um before we even get started with this video give this video a thumbs up subscribe and uh, um keep watching okay so first we're just gonna be taking the pictures that we imported and we're gonna just drag those down to our timeline that's what it's called so So that's all that's all that I'm editing right now so the first thing the very first thing I like to do is change the white balance so when my videos be looking all bright and stuff it's because I change the white balance because I don't like the way that it comes off my camera it's hard when you have two separate clips because the lighting can like touch in different places so the balance won't be the same if that makes sense so that's why you see like the two different hues of colors because the light hit in different directions and it just wasn't the same. And y'all see I keep clicking it. It may not look noticeable but I can notice it like the uh, tones of color like my skin it changes. So the next thing that I do is I see that it's way too loud like I'm not trying to make y'all deaf. <laughs> so I go and I turn the audio a bit down. Um, In the second clip you can see how it's yellow that means it's way too loud and you need to turn it down. So sometimes I just lose my train of thought and I have pauses in my video and this is how I cut them out. I split the clip and then I just delete it. Like, I just press the delete key. So now we have a smooth sailing video, no pauses. At the end of my clips, I, you know, turn the camera off, like I stop recording. And I don't like showing that part, so again, I'm gonna split the clip. And I'm just going to delete that so you won't see me reaching for the camera. So I'm trying to change like the tone again. It was just bothering me. Like I don't know. I was just playing around with it. Because I just, I just wanted it to be perfect. So that's all I'm doing right here. Okay, so now I'm working on the second clip, um, turning the volume down like I said. Um, audio just makes it more clear sounding, I guess, I don't know. So basically what this clip is, I'm basically just watching it through to make sure that, you know, I didn't mess up or anything. And so I just fast forwarded it because y'all can't even hear it anyway. <laughs> So I reached for the camera at the end again, so I just split that and I just cut it out. And then this part, <laughs> excuse all my footages or whatever. So I'm looking for my intro. My intro is just saved in the iMovie. That's what I love about iMovie. It's somewhere around here. 
So I just changed the sound or the volume on my intro too because it needs to be loud but not too loud. Like I said, I'm not trying to make y'all deaf. <laughs> so now it's time for me to add the transitions. So before my intro, I like to use fade to white because it's a white intro. And after my intro, I like to use cross dissolve because I feel like it just dissolves right into the video so smoothly. And so for like after a video or like after a clip, I always add slide right. The transition like I just honestly love slide right it's just I don't know I feel like it's so like neat I guess okay so so many of you guys have asked me um, how I edit or how I add things like the subscribe button or whatever so I'm gonna show you so we're gonna go to YouTube and in the search bar we're gonna type green screen subscribe button and it's gonna bring you all these options and you just click the one that you want then we're going to just go to this website. Um, I kind of freezed it for y'all because I know I was kind of moving kind of fast. But this website. You want to copy the link from the video. And then you want to paste it um, onto the website. And just click download y'all. Like it's that easy. And then it's saved to your computer as an mp4. So you can either import it or you can drag it straight from the download bar thingy. Um, to your TL or to your video. I like to just drag it because I have so many documents y'all So basically what I'm doing now is just trying to fit the video within my words So when I say subscribe, I want the subscribe button to pop up. So it's all about like the timing so I just delete The end of the video because it's just like a repetitive loop kind of thing You know, I make it short. I make it go once and then it's done. So this is the funnest part. iMovie has like a um, green screen video overlay type of thing. And so here's how it works. All right, so you want to click the little two boxes. It's gonna bring a drop down menu. Click green slash blue screen. And boom, it's just that easy y'all. so I forgot to record an outro so I'm editing but I just wanted to say that if you enjoyed this video um, give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and any questions you want anything explained um, don't hesitate to comment below and I got y'all